uh, to take part in this exhibition with so many other artists who are based in Milton Keynes or associated with Milton Keynes. Uh, it's inspiring, it's uh, diverse in the range of approaches, uh, and it's a significant chapter in Milton Keynes' history and its culture and moving forward with MK Gallery. Ah, it's, it's great to have your work seen, um, and it's also great to be part of the 50 year celebrations. I also um, don't normally show work in gallery spaces. I like to reach a broader audience, and um, it intrigued me how the backroom spaces were going to be brought into use, the loading bay, um, storage rooms, so it wasn't it was more accessible in that people don't have to walk through the door of a white cube building. So that's why I particularly wanted to show here. We've never shown our work um, amongst art rather than photography. So it's been really great to kind of, you know, really interact with a wide range of art forms um, and see the amazing stuff that's happening in Milton Keynes. There's so many good ideas in there. Yeah. Lots of you know, painting and sculpture and sound installations and loads of different things. So it's great to, from our perspective yeah. to see our work within that context. Yeah. To be in this exhibition is um, a, another step for me as an artist after leaving, um, finishing university, sorry. Um, and, you know, just kind of getting my work out there and getting people to see what I make. The idea of bringing together groups of people who have like some kind of affiliation to, well for me, my hometown, um, is really exciting, uh, a really exciting sort of general survey of what's going on or what could be happening or how it's happening um, and that's something to be proud to be part of I think.